I'm going to make an analogy here. This isn't a video about firearms. I'm just initially using the subject to make a point. As we know, if you make guns illegal, it's not going to stop everyone from having guns. It will certainly cut them down. If we make discriminating against someone for their race, sex, sexual orientation, or religion illegal, like we do, it's not going to stop everyone from discriminating against someone for those things. It will certainly cut them down. We can have it on the books that everything is supposed to be equal, that there's not supposed to be preferential treatment to anyone from any demographic, like we do, but it doesn't mean that everything is going to be that way. This is why it is so patently absurd to suggest that because there's a handful of black people who have been able to be successful, that racism in the United States is basically gone. How ignorant and arrogant, apathetic, or at the very least, oblivious can you possibly be to make that kind of statement? This especially goes out to those who don't even live here in the United States, making absolutist declarations that racism is dead in the United States. Is this when people chime in and say that black people should expect to be treated like criminals because look at the statistics? Should gay people expect to be treated as icky because look at the statistics? Should women who enjoy sex be looked at as sluts because look at the single mother statistics? Should straight white men expect to be treated as serial killers and mass murderers because look at the statistics?